This video is to demonstrate Windows 7 Media Center using a Citon Infinite TV 4 digital cable quad tuner card. In this video, I will show channel tuning, changing, recording, playback, and search indexing. The first thing we're going to take a look at is the guide. What you notice with the guide is how smooth it is to navigate, unlike a cable company's box. Left, right, up and down, everything runs smoothly. Uh, let's actually tune a channel and get a general idea of the channel changing speed and quality now. Now, while we're watching a program, we can also pull up the mini guide. The mini guide lets you change to another program while still having the majority of the program you're watching in the background. We're going to tune a few more uh, separate channels for a few seconds just to get a really full idea of uh, channel changing. Now let's take a look at the recording capability. The Infinite TV 4 card can record four separate things at one time. Um, I do have one of these uh, tuners uh, dedicated to another room, so right now I can only do three, but there you go. I set three recordings simultaneously to record later in the day. And uh, I don't actually intend on recording those, so we're going to uncheck those and... Uh, Check something else out. Let's actually go back and um, take a look at the pre-recorded stuff, uh, the stuff I've already recorded, and uh, show you a little bit about playback and so on. Uh, first thing is the sorting. You can sort it by date recorded, you can sort it by title, which will just have the title of the show, and inside that, episodes, you can show by original air date and shared. Uh, most of the time, I use title, and uh, I go to the specific show and see all the episodes I recorded for that show. Uh, here's Thundercats. Let's actually play a little bit of an episode so you can see what's going on. Let's actually sample uh, one more recording uh, that I did and um, just to show it off a little bit, uh, skip through it a little bit uh, so you can see a few scenes and have a full idea. Okay, uh, let's go to the movie guide. Uh, the movie guide will actually show you anything that's currently airing on cable TV right now, or going to be, uh, movie-wise. So right now I can see Twilight, uh, George of the Jungle 2, and look, Goodfellas. Goodfellas is playing on Spike TV right now. So uh, let's check it out. Essentially, it's a nice way to always know what movies are playing on cable. 
uh, you don't have to scroll through 700 channels to see what actual movie movies are on. You can just go there. Uh, let me show you uh, the categories. Uh, the Basically, you have most viewed movies, HDTV, sports, kids, on-demand news. It's pretty straightforward. You also have the search option. But I'm not going to use this search option. I'll do it from the main menu and show you the full search indexing. Over here, you can type in a title of a show, a keyword of a show, uh, categories also, which is right here. With This is beautiful. Let's say I want kid shows and I want adventure. It will show me any adventure kid show coming on cable for this foreseeable future. Comedies, same thing. So, much like a Netflix, for example, uh, where a Netflix, you choose a genre, uh, on this, it's the same thing. You can choose a genre and just read through the you know, synopsis and see what channel they're coming on and what time and set it to record. It really is a fantastic feature. Well, I think that's the bulk of uh, this demo, and... Uh, I highly recommend um, Windows 7 Media Center Edition with a Infinite TV 4 cable card tuner. Uh, thanks for watching the video and uh, have a nice day. If you have any ideas that you think would make a great video, please send us a message.